Hi everybody, welcome very much to my YouTube channel. Today I'm ready to bring you the third match out of a best of five between in the color orange it's sort of and on the color red it's Fei Chan and sort of is playing the French. Fei playing the Abbasid Dynasty and the map is Frisian Marshes filled with little ponds of fish everywhere across the map very short distance between our players and a lot of sheep actually around the base so very good start for our players here and this is a best of five out of the most recent tournament from etc tv called call to arms round one of the swiss stage group c if you want to check that online and if you enjoy the content leave a like and subscribe to my channel and use the links down below to catch me live on Twitch and to cast to catch the organizer EGCTV live on Twitch as well. Go over there and support them so they can make more and better tournaments as well. And the matchup, Abbasid Dynasty versus the French, it favors Abbasid uh, theoretically because they have very good spears, uh, they they have very good archers, they have cheaper villagers. They can go for a lot of horsemen and then they will be economically ahead than the French because the French usually build knights which are very very expensive and most times it's like a Basset can defend on feudal and then uh, they go castle first than the French or they just have way more units than the French on feudal lunch. But let's see how they work. Recently French has been working on a second TC. Abbasid always likes to go for more TCs and they also are very much about uh, going for that military wing opening. We have been that we have been seeing that a lot today. A military wing opening from the Abbasid into their feudal age. Let's see if that works in on this map. That's a lot of sheep for sort of actually. So there was already matches played out of this set and they are also published on the channel. So if you want to know what happened before this match, go check the other matches. There we go, military wing coming in for Fecha on the Abbasid dynasty. Sort of going with the classical school of cavalry from the French. That makes all the stables, including that, produce cavalry 20% faster. And the military wing will spawn two archers and two spears immediately. To provoke some aggression usually that aggression is applied on the french gold because the french makes one knight that loses to the two spears and two archers i think with very good micro you can at least kill two archers but i think you still lose the knight or your knight gets really really low and then you have to wait for chivalry to actually use it for harassment other than that thank you very much for watching guys your support is greatly appreciated where are the scouts there we go Scouts from Fei Chan coming back to the base. That's a lot of sheep. Yeah, because there's a lot of sheep on this map around the base too. Ooh, not a lot of sheep for sort of, but this scout was full. There we go. That, that scout is filled with sheep. Beautiful. So, School of Cavalry almost finished. There will be a first knight coming out. I don't think so. Not immediately, at least. Military wing. We'll spawn those archers and spears. And let's see what will be the target of Feichan with that opening. Barracks as well. Ah, for the upgrade. Smart, smart. Very smart. There you go, archers and spears. And I think they're going directly for the gold. For their pathing. From their pathing, I can assume that. First knight is out. The, 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 the scout is there. He's like, I know you here, man. He wants to go for the stone. Abbasid already working on that second TC. No second TC for the French. Alright. Valuable, uh, viable choice. Valid choice. Oh, 
Oh, oh, oh. French. Sort of pulling back. Almost lost one wheel, but it was okay. Wait, I heard something being destroyed. I, I think they cancelled a, a military building. Archery range coming in. That's a second night for the French. For sort of. Fetcha keeps the high pressure with the spears and archer. Two knights. It's way more complicated to deal with. Oh, fate targeting the scout. It's really good. His knights have basically no vision. It's really hard to use knights for raids when you don't have the scout with it. Good micro... Oh, that's a third spear. Nice. Almost going down. There's a horseman. That's a good plan from the French. Just make some horsemen so you, you don't invest so much into units. So you can keep up with the Abbasid economy. Remember that the French do produce uh, villagers faster, but sometimes that's not enough. Bro, the Abbasid units scream so much and so loud. It's so funny. That's enough stone for the TC, which will be dropped on the berries. Right in the front of the base, protects the gold over there. And, oh, French is now moving for the second TC. Alright. I like that play. Uh, maybe, I think it's a bit late, but it's a good play. Nevertheless, it's a good play. Archer, under pressure from those two archers. Good charge with the knights there. Does not pick any will, but they're very, very low. Bro, that's what I like. Early feudal age action where the where the micro really matters. One spear goes down. Oh, sort of almost picked the villager. His archers are getting very low. When Archer goes down, there is still enough spears there to defend the Vils. More spears arriving, and the TC is completed, and one knight goes down for sort of. That's huge. No, I think two knights went down. That's 280 food and 200, and 200 gold. Right? Because it's 140, 100. That's a lot, bro. That's a lot. And the army from Faye keeps growing. Eight spears already. Only three knights for Sort of. Sort of can always attack through. Uh, no, I think you take damage. No, no, you, I think if you pass through here, you don't take damage from the TC. I'm not entirely sure. Five, five archers only. Not, not more units in. Oh, there is no gold. Ah, chivalry is coming in online. All right. Yeah, those knights need some healings. Oh, we can pick a villager there. No. I think you can see it now with the scout. Oh, the villager is already going in. Yeah, you delete the corners, right? They need to fix that, bro. There is no need that players need to delete the corners of their own walls. They just need to fix whatever it is. a lot of spears. 12 spears already. For sort of. For Fey, I mean. Sort of moves to the gold. Only 7 villagers on the gold. Second DC is right there on the fish and gold. Beautiful play. Beautiful spot. Because this map is good for the French because their meals only cost 25 wood so you can... Bro, look, a meal here with wheelbarrow. It's perfect. Okay, only seven archers, <gasps> horsemen coming in, bro, yeah, and that, that's when it really gets complicated for the French, is because you need the, the archers to counter the spears, but then your enemy just makes way more um, horsemen than you make knights, and it, it, it gets complicated, right? Still a lot of spears in the back, only nine archers, for sort of, he needs to get his numbers growing ASAP. Oh, knights can do for a raid. There is nobody to raid. You can get the wheels there. You can see it. You can see it. It's, yeah, the knights are... 
They are legally blind. Archers being chased. Sort of losing a lot of military already. The destroyed value is very high for Faye, not very high for uh, sort of. But the economy from sort of is starting to skyrocket. Sort of making more knights. We have more stables. We have two stables because the school of cavalry does count as a stable. Horsemen keep chasing the knights. Slowly but surely, they might get that knockout. Oh, damn. You don't want to be there, knights. You don't want to be right there. Good maneuvers. I think the knights will make it out alive. They do. Let's go. The heroes. They come back to tell the story. Up to seven knights and 12 archers. Oh, a camel archer comes in to debuff the knights. Beautiful play from Faye. Right, 17 archers, that's a good number actually from archers, two archery ranges on, already online, that's nice, you have to be careful, that's a lot of spears, range damage coming in, attack the board, attack the board with archers, they're not right now. Right, sort of looking for an angle. Let's switch for income per minute. Ooh, a basket with a lot of food. Are they are on the fish. They have wheelbarrow. Not good night raid. I like this. Nice. Sort of is ahead by three. Wait. Did the basket went for a 30 C? Because sort of was way more ahead. Not maybe he wasn't producing villagers for a while. Ooh, a basket almost castle. Sorov is very far away from castle phase right there with more army. That's what I was, you see like you lose a couple units with French and It's basically like free castle age for a basset because they have Leftovers for, from fresh foodstuffs. They produce cheaper units than you on the horseman and then they just go castle Also, they have 15% uh, plus gathering rate from a uh, uh, golden age tier one Plus any upgrade that they get a uh, wheelbarrow or fertilization so they always have a better economy than you. You might have, because look, the difference is not huge, right? So the, the French economy is not better at the moment. And even if it is, you're producing way more expensive units. Oh, good, nice. So the knights can do more damage now. The spears are far away. The horsemen are eating the archers alive. Uh oh. Oh, it's not enough archers. Good surround with the horseman, well played, Faye. Very good surround with the horses, with the horses, with the horsemen there. The archers had no chance, and they go down again. They are fighting in the water. Run. I don't know. Fake can go castle any minute. Oh, knights, no! They all go down. Sort of was not paying attention. And now Sort of is like with very little units. Very far away from castle. 
FA is aging up right now with economical win to have better farms and cheaper farms. Sort of goes for several techniques so the villagers can get deer quicker, faster, better, stronger. Horseman looking for a raid. Yeah, I think they are looking for a raid while you wage up. That's good. Sort of coming back in the military numbers, but guess what? Phase castle in about 25 seconds. And uh, good number of military production. Golden Age tier 2 already activated, so they have more res res research speed. And in 28 more buildings, production speed plus 20%, which is the really powerhouse of Asset Imperial late game. Right, good wall here for sort of the horseman did not attack, so the walls will be there. Okay, nice damage, good pickups on the archers, and 40, no, 6 villager lead for sort of good food income per minute, I think sort of can go custom soon, soonish, phase castle, getting composite bows, one of the most broken upgrades in the game, it will give 33% attack speed to their archers, 33% guys, that's crazy. They attack almost every second. Attack speed, 1.12 guys. Every 1.12 seconds, they attack. Wait, it's, no, it's minutes. No, it's not me. <laughs> it's seconds. It can be once per minute, that's ridiculous. <gasps> that could be some good picks. To increase the villager lead. Go, go, go. Nah, 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 nah. That's. We don't want to do that. Horseman coming in. Horseman, uh, uh, knights running around. Yeah, you can kill those spears, it's okay. Veteran knights, veteran archers coming in. Manganel on the field. Ooh, archers, gotta be careful. The Manganel is looking at you. The Manganel is looking for you. L look at it, it's smelling you. Archers, come here. I got some presents for you. They fly. And they're heavy. It's some flying rocks. Good shots from the Manganel. Boom. Huge damage on the archers, bro. N 
but I think no archer is no one archer went down there. But the spears are going down. Yeah, that's a very good engagement from Sorov. Oh, but there is crossbows in there. I didn't realize it. There are crossbows in there. And the knights are just going down for a bunch of archers and some crossbows. It's crazy. And more army coming in, more gulams, more crossbows, more archers. Oh, there's a lot of archers from the French over there. Ah, the gulams will just destroy them. <sighs> Looking tough. No knights for the French. Only 20 archers on the field. Ah, looking tough, guys. Looking tough. For sort of great attack from Faye. So many units, bro. 66. It just tell a fight. Bro, sometimes playing against the Vassid feels really unfair. They always have 60 units. Always. Always. Even though, like, they lost 30. Another 30 just spawned. Another manganel. Let's go. Some rams. Try to start to destroy some buildings. Bring the heat. Bring the pressure. Double spring of emplacement. Doesn't do, it should do way more to the rams, bro. Like way more. Bro, Faye with double the military from Sorov. Sorov with way more units, bro. Almost 30 villager lead. He killed 38 villagers when we weren't looking on the raids, bro. That's awesome. But still, his economy is sucks. And he has no units in comparison to Faye. Trying to grab the relics. All alone? No. Go, run, 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 run. Osman Raid. Monastery going down. Oh, there is a market over there. Oh, but there is no trade post here. So that's just to exchange some resources for something else. Uh oh, Vil's under pressure. Villager lead less than 20 now. It second TC and barracks under pressure, and the farms too. <laughs> okay, our volunteer with with a pale with a shield with a PV. Okay, okay, French army hanging on nicely. There is two manganels there, right? One of them does go down. 
But more units are arriving for the Abbasi. And French has no units. I can hear GG in the chat. Let's go. GG gets called. Very well played from Faye. Shout out to both players. They played really well, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Your support is greatly appreciated. Leave a like, subscribe, comment. Catch me on Twitch and I see you soon.